I don't know, it, dep it depends on what restrictions. Thank you, Sunberry. Dragon Rage! Hold on! This horrible Magikarp has a chance! Dwagon! A speed 7. Hold on! No, Lord was last run, Sunberry. Oops, I should have taken the Super Potion. We have a chance! We have a chance. As long as we either outspeed or it doesn't Oko us, we should just Oko it. Come on, survive. Our special defense is 11. We survived! Let's go! Magikarp made it out of the lab! What are the odds? <laughs> I mean, I'm so tempted just to run this to see what happens when we evolve. What does Gyarados... Well, wait, no. It's not gonna be a Gyarados. Milotic Blastoise for Alligator? Whoa. It can evolve into some monsters. I'm tempted to do a Magikarp Evo run. Is that wrong of me? Am I a monster? Is it either short-lived or the stuff of legend? Wow, another super potion? We're getting really good healing items? Help, Sunberry, I'm getting attached. If we beat this next trainer, this Magikarp is our PB. By the way. And we learn a move in two levels, and then we evolve in seven levels. So see where it says I'm level 13 with the parentheses 20 next to it? That 20 means what level does it evolve? My unintentional son. You picked this Sunberry. This is entirely your fault. As with many things, it is all Sunberry's fault. Tyranitar, yikes. Earthquake, yikes. I do have good defense. Okay, okay. Shit. Uh, what do we do? Chat, help. My potion, it uses Earthquake again. I think I'm gonna potion. Just uses Earthquake again. Oh, it's a loafer! Dang it! Um, do I set up a Harden? Is two Pokemon? No, I'm just gonna go for Dragon Range. Extra Sensory. Well, maybe your special attack is way worse. Okay, uh, Tyranitar has low special attack, we've learned. It has high HP. Did it survive the Dragon Rage? I learned beat up. Uh, how does beat up work? I feel like it's more likely I'd want beat up than that I'd want encore. I mean, beat up is practically tackle. Brunch. Okay, I should survive that. I can't believe. Our new PB is a Magikarp, by the way. Our new PB is a Magikarp. Oh, Matt Scrain's got HP. If it survives Dragon Rage, I'm writing that down. Only four levels away from evolving. And no matter what we evolve into, we'll have Dragon Rage. And thankfully, I'm as tanky as a 200 BST Pokemon can be. 24 defense, 26 special defense. Regirock! Oh! My last super potion. My only other healing. I found a bunch of Pokeballs. Modest nature, too. We evolve into a special attacker. Future Sight! Ooh, that could be good for me. Because it didn't damage me this turn. Won't damage me next turn. Won't damage me the turn after. 
Let's see if I can take out whatever this next Pokemon is. Is it? Masquerain. Uh, we dealt with one of you before. It had high HP, but it only had Fire Punch and Barrage, so I think we can do this. Okay! We survived this trainer. Believe in the heart of Dwagon. Tanky Magikarp for the win! Sentences I never thought I'd say. And a reminder, I cannot leave Brock's gym. I have to defeat every trainer in there, and I have to, uh... Hopefully we get enough experience to Evo at the first trainer. Let's... I need 489 experience. And then I will evolve and cross my fucking fingers. All right, here it comes. Butterfree, that should be enough. Rude. All right. Mega kick, okay. 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 We got the evolution. What? Dwagon is evolving. What is it? What is it? What is it? Starmie, okay. Not the best, but I'll take it. Oh shit, does Starmie learn any moves? Starmie learns one move. No. Okay, how about my special attack stat? What's your ability? Hustle. <laughs> Trades accuracy for power of physical moves when I'm a special attacker. High speed. Like, good stats. I more than doubled my HP. Like... Okay. Okay. All right. Come on, Magikarp. Let's go. Let's kick his ass. <laughs> he leads with ho ho. <laughs> Mega horn. Oh no, that's super effective. My ho oh has no HP. Wingle has HP. All right, we have beaten Brock. <sighs> All right, and we have Petal Dance as our only move of any substance. Well, wait, we can see what TM39 is. Hyper Boys, thank God! Uh, well, I would, never mind, our attack is 17. Not thank God, but it's useful. Let's see if we can learn it. Flame Wheel! Oh my God! Well, let's see if I can learn it. Yes! We can learn it! Oh, I, I panicked myself for a second there. Odor Sleuth, gross. All right, move tutors, let's see what you got for me. Outrage. <laughs> uh, nope, can't learn it, damn. Oh, that would, be, that would be so good to upgrade Dragon Rage into Outrage. Signal Beam? Tell me more. Level 33, this is our level up move, our only level up move of the run. What? What? What just happened? Why didn't I get a level up move? Does it mean my level up move was something I already know? I'm checking the logs. 
I'm going to the logs right now. It's level 33 move is Hyper Voice. Okay. The level 33 move was Hyper Voice, which is the TM that Brock gave us. That's a shame, but it is what it is. Okay, Psybeam, let's see. Not able! Ah, that's so disappointing. All right, Misty is defeated. Cascade badge, what's your TM? I use cut. Received TM03. It contained Nightshade. Can I learn it? Not able to learn it, so I don't even need to think about it. There's, I, I might consider teaching that over Hyper Voice. Take the Thunder Badge. Cranks up your Pokemon speed, that's right. I can fly anytime. TM34. Bone Meringue. Huh. Spit after all. I think I need to leave now. I don't think grinding a couple extra trainers of experience is worth uh, using more healing items. Unless, what if I was greedy? Aerodactyl. Um, Petal Dance. All right, now we leave. Greed time, you say. Draw two more Pokemon. It's funny because this trick. Oh my god! Oh no! Aerodactyl is the tankiest thing we've ever encountered. And I just locked myself into Petal Dance. Oh hecky. Weather Ball. Okay, I resist water. Okay, it does nothing there. Oh hecky. Alright. Alright. The greed was good. And now we're done. That was enough greed. I would like to save my items. Oh shit! Where was this trainer? This trainer is unavoidable right there at the exit. Well, now I'm gonna have to use a healing item. So because I have to use a healing item, I can go farm more stuff in here. I'm annoyed by the underground path not having spawned any items, so that means I need to spend a lot of time step farming. Wait, I have, I have it. It launches the boom boomerangs with water. Hmm. It'd be hard to get the proper spin. Yeah, that's true. Well, I mean, we've seen when it, like, hurls itself around the yeah when it, um, you know, spin throws itself. For like rapid spin and such, so that gets lots of spin out of it. We've seen that from Misty's Starmie. Rainbow badge get summoning potion spell, summoning good TM spell. TM19 contains Crab Hammer. That's a water type move. <gasps> Can we learn it? Can we learn it? 19. Crab hammer? Dang it! No! Such a shame. Starmie's going far. Further than I ever expected a Magikarp run to be going. Please be good. Meditate. Doom Desire. That's. Jirachi's uh, future sight, right? Can't even learn it. That's unfortunate. Where's the last TM? Right over by Surf. Okay, so we are there. <gasps> Shell Bell! Yes! That's healing! That's the best thing we could have gotten. Give it to me. So Shell Bell heals 
uh, one sixteenth of the damage that I deal, I believe. Gold teeth. Thunder punch! Please, 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 please. Dang it! <laughs> Why can't I learn any of these sweet moves? <laughs> no! Come on, lady. Teach you the bone rush technique. What is bone rush? So it's a worse version of bone meringue? Can I learn it? Let's see first. I can't even learn it, so not even a thing. Meteor Mesh, that's a good move. It's an okay, I mean, it's not the best, but it's fine because it's inaccurate. Can I learn it? It's also using my wrong stats. I can't learn it. All right, I'm gonna go flip a table. I'll be right back. Oh no, I'm frozen solid! I can't believe I've been frozen solid at least three times and gotten to burst out of it with a flame wheel. Like, that never happens. I'm enjoying it. I could go with the ice beam. I have it marked as a high physical defense. Well, I guess I'm gonna use a flame wheel to heal the freeze. Ice punch, please, please, please. Ah! <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> ah. Level 80. Thank you. Good DM, please, Koga. The defense of your Pokemon rises. Also lets you surf outside of battle. TM06. Rock slide. And we can't learn it! Ah! Why? You're a TM, Mr. Item. TMO2, it contains rest. That is technically a healing move, and I can shorten the duration. Well, let, let's see, we can learn it. I can shorten the duration with my flutes. I can learn it. So I do have access to a mediocre healing move in a dire situation. In a gym or in the Elite Four where I've run out of uh, healing. Teaching you the move Hydro Cannon! <laughs> I only learned once. Who's the Pokemon that gets to learn Hydro Cannon? I don't even get the chance to agonize over the choice! Of course not! This is just a meme at this point. Charm. Pursuit. Nope! Want me to teach Bone Club? Um, so that's an electrode. It is a TM and an item. Come on, Tiongar. That one's the TM. I'm gonna grab the item first. A red flute. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Smoke screen. Ooh. Assist. Zap cannon. Can't even learn it. I like it, it's. I probably wouldn't because fifty percent accuracy. But I can't even. I don't even get the option. Pseudo Woodo. Taunting me by knowing water pulse. Evil. Evil. 
You become the... <laughs> pseudo Woodo with Water Pulse. You become the very thing you swore to destroy. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, you're just super tanky on all, all fronts. Endeavor? Oh god, that sets my HP equal to yours! And that means it has Endeavor, so if I use a healing item, it could theoretically Endeavor again. So I'm gonna kill it, and then heal on whatever comes out next. I do not like that. Scizor. Do I know anything about this? It has rough skin! Oh my god, I almost attacked it! I have notes that it has rough skin. That would have killed me. That would have been the run. Alright, let's use... Use fresh water. I think we'll use a Do I want to use just... I think I'll use the fresh water. Yeah, I think I'll save the Moomoo Milk and we'll use the fresh water. Sandstorm's annoying. How much damage is that? A lot. We'll heal off of the um, Shell Bell. The rough skin will hurt us. We know that. Yep, but now we heal back 1 16th of Scizor's HP. Heracet. Oh, the sandstorm has almost killed me. I'm gonna just, uh. And we'll up. Unless it has rough skin, in which case, I threw. Well, that's annoying. I think I'm just gonna blow all of those small heals. Save the Moo Moo Milk. And save the Max Potions. These ones I don't really want to be using during battle anyway, because they're so small. Right, back up to 100 HP. I have one Max Potion and two full restores. That endeavor scared me more than I had any right to. The rest of the gym was easy after we got out of that scissor sandstorm rough skin situation. But so I didn't need to use the moo milk, but I'm glad I did, because if I didn't and I died, I would have felt bad. Like TMO4, come on. Come on. You don't tell me what it is, I have to go look. Dragon Claw? No! That would have been so good! Oh! Why can't I learn anything? For a little while. Just to hear the music, enjoy it. Ooh, Lavender Town Queepy. A Moo Moo Milk. Two moos. Two moo, two furious. It's family milk. Ew. Max Potion! Thank you, game. Thank you. Thank you for your generosity. I appreciate you very much. Oh, I, I thought I had uh, two full restores, one max potion before. I had two full, two full restores. Now I have two full restores, two max potions. Nice, that's great. Another Lumberry, that's also great. Thank you, game. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, oh, that's a hidden item. Moo Moo Milk! Oh, Pokemon Mansion, you have been very generous to me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Family Milk. Come on, good TM that I can learn. Clamp. 
That's technically a water type move. Can't learn it. <laughs> oh my god, this game is cruel to me. Secret key. Come on, this TM. Please, please, please. Luster Purge. That's a psychic type move. I wish I'd looked at what TM number it was. I need to pay attention to that so it's easier to go see. Please, 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 Luster Purge. We can learn it. We can learn it. We can learn it. Oh my God. So, Luster Purge. Dragon wants to learn it, yes. So, obviously we're keeping Flame Wheel, we're keeping Bone Meringue, those are great coverage. So it's between Petal Dance and Signal Beam. I think I'm going to get rid of Signal Beam, because it uses our worst attack stat, and the coverage of grass and bug is similar enough for the things that are problems for me that it's not a huge loss. Plus Luster Purge versus things that are special defense walls. It lowers the special defense 50% chance, so that's really good. Yeah, and then if we get like a water move or a recovery move or something, we'll delete Petal Dance for it. And this is why I've been saving those, uh, those PP maxes. Use on Luster Purge. Nice. All right, there is Luster Purge. Officially our best move, but it's low PP, so we're gonna try and use them sparingly. Nice. Purge that luster. And to confirm, luster purge is 50%? To drop a spit off? Yeah, 50%. And it's non contact, which is huge. Non contact with good accuracy, finally. Far fetched, okay. That is not something super scary. TM38, Solar Beam. <laughs> Is that better or worse than Petal Dance? I don't know. Don't waste it on weak Pokemon indeed. Is that better or worse than Petal Dance? I think it's worse. Well, let's see if I can even learn it. TM38, Solar Beam. I could learn it. Okay. Interesting. And there goes Giovanni. Come on, great TM. Give me something great. TM26. Name's Fisher. <laughs> That's so close to vanilla. That's so funny to me. It's a powerful technique. Uh, gym eight. Let's see if I can learn it. I'm curious. I'm not going to, but. Gym 26. Nope, can't learn Fisher. 